This is our American Termaster 1550 GTW lathe. The G stands for gearhead and the TW stands for 3B way vet, which we'll get into more details in just a second. This is one of our many manual lathes made of cast iron and we're going to discuss the key features that make this such a hot seller. Let's start with the headstock. The headstock has a 16 speed spindle with ranges from 20 to 1600 RPMs. It is a single speed motor with constant horsepower at all speed ranges. It also comes available with an electronic variable speed. It also comes with a heavy duty cam lock spindle of D16. But what really makes this machine so unique is that it comes with a disc clutch in the headstock. What are the advantages? One, it can start or stop the spindle without starting or stopping the main motor. This helps control with the starting speed of the spindle, which is very important when you have an unevenly distributed part on the chuck or a very heavy part. And this also adds to the motor longevity. Getting into the universal gearbox, it is a totally enclosed universal gearbox that provides both inch and metric threads without having to change the end train gears to save time. The clutch in the apron and the shear pin in the lead screw help protect against overload. There are centralized push button controls with e-stop and the spindle jog. The carriage and the cross slide also have key features. The cross slide itself is wide and full length and it's externally dovetailed for quick and easy mounting of accessories. It also comes with micrometer dials both in inch and metric with direct readings and this is for the cross and compound feeds. Apron is totally enclosed, double wall type apron with adjustable trip control to allow for maximum accuracy when turning shoulder lengths. There's also a feed reverse from the apron which has an independent control for longitudinal and cross feed engagement. Moving on to the bed. The bed has 3V way bed design. Um, this is extremely important because not a lot of manual lathes out there have this design. Usually they're just 2V way bed. But the 3 V-Way bed is significant because it provides perfect alignment of the saddle and its travel and eliminates hesitation to the back of the saddle. It's also a gap bed design, meaning that you can remove the gap and you increase the swing slightly on the machine, so it gives you that extra sort of flexibility. Tailstock itself, a lot of people may not know this, but the tailstock has an American King slot, which allows you to easily remove the center or other tools that you may potentially have on the lathe. The chip and the coolant tray are located conveniently in the front of the lathe, which allows for an operator to easily remove it and again, keeping your area really nice and clean. Other safety features that are really important is there's a full length foot brake, so it makes it really easy for the operator to be able to stop the machine. Another key feature is that all the cables itself are actually being enclosed within this accordion type protection, so it keeps everything really just compact. The actual footprint of the machine is kept to a very small area. I think the key points for you to take away from this machine is that this tool room lathe is very user friendly. We spoke about those key features, like the safety features such as that full length foot brake, the lead screw protection cover, the cables being protected, that disc matrix clutch in the headstock, which really makes this machine the go-to engine lathe for your tool room. For more information about our manual lathes, please check us out at www.lagoon.com.